reporting for Kids First, and today I'm interviewing actresses Honor Nipsey and um, Eva Wittnager, who made the main characters in Wolf Walkers, Robin and Meth. So hi, how are you guys? I'm good, thank you. I'm how good, are you? how are you? I'm awesome. So I just want to congratulate both of you before we start the interview for getting a nomination on Best Voice Actresses and a nominated Critics' Choice Super Awards. How do you guys feel about that? I mean, it's crazy. It doesn't even seem real, to be honest. But yeah, I just feel really lucky. It's so surreal. It's really cool. Yeah, that's awesome. I'm so proud of you guys. And let me tell you that the voice work in this film was impeccable. And I salute you guys for that. Um, and both of your characters are very different in this film. I mean, Robin, she's um, more cautious. And I feel like Meph is more of like a free spirit. So why do you think your characters really became so close at the end? I think they kind of realised, although, yeah, at first they have their differences, when they really got to know each other and they took away the initial fear, they really had more in common than they realised. Yeah, absolutely. I think they created, like, a really special bond um, and at the end they practically became, like, you know, a family. Um and Honor, I know you've worked in like some other projects, but this is your first animated feature. So how was it challenging to give your voice life to Robin? I mean, it's definitely more challenging because you have to portray all of these emotions just through your voice, not through any emotion on your face or physically. You've got to really get into character, block out everything that's going on around you and just look at the individual words and try and get them out in a certain way. Yeah, absolutely. But I think you nailed it. And Eva, this is your big debut. How exciting. So how was your experience in the booth? It was just so much fun. Like you said, it was my first project. So I really just had the best time. Awesome. Um, did you guys work together like in the same um, area? Or were you guys kind of like separated due to like COVID and everything? I mean, this was before COVID. So me and Eva actually got to work together. Well, that's so lucky because imagine if it was now, then I, everything would have been like more different. But I think you guys could really create a like, special connection. Um, was it hard to find the spirit of your characters? Eva, do you want to go? Um, well, I know when I first read the script, I kind of had an idea of how I wanted to play Maeve. But obviously, when we were in the actual room recording together and getting direction from Tom and Ross, um, uh, the character kind of strengthened and I got more used to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and um, I think this film, you know, it really experiences like life outside, um, I guess, our walls. Um, so what... And it also like really talks about the love, you know, of nature and importance. So what do you think audiences will take away from this incredible film? By the way, I loved it. It's definitely one of my new favorite films, like of all times. Oh, thank you. I mean, I hope they obviously enjoy it. And it's such an entertaining piece of a lovely story. And it really does emphasize the importance of our nature and how we really need to look after it. Yeah, well, thank you guys so, so much for talking with me. I really appreciated it. And once again, congratulations on this incredible film. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and check out some of our other Kids First reviewers and reporters on this channel. Bye now.